Hi everyone, it's Kelly. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to my new subscribers and happy Wednesday. Today I'm super excited to announce that I will be guest designing for a Colorful Life Design stencils throughout the month of January. I was absolutely honored when they reached out and said, would you like to guest design for us? And go ahead over to the store and choose what you'd like to work with. And they sent me this amazingly generous package with super fun items that you'll be seeing throughout January 2023 and I'm really excited. I couldn't wait. I had to get started, so I went ahead and made a sample. Stencils are amazing. These are one of those things that you really need to have in your crafting supplies because they are easy to use. They're versatile. I mean, you can use them over and over again. So many different ways that you can use them. Each time you use them, it'll probably be a little bit different. And not to mention cleanup is super easy. Take a little wipey and it's done. Store it away. So for the first card that I wanted to make, of course, it had to be a Starbucks inspired coffee card and so I'm using M20119 coffee stains. You can see here has a little bit of a ring that when you set your coffee cup down and then the little splatter marks is super absolutely adorable. Here's the card that I made if you follow me on Instagram which is also linked in the description box below. You saw this debut this morning and I think this turned out so cute. Love, love this. Now the magic, if you notice, is behind the stamped image is the stencil and only the stencil. So this entire card took less than 10 minutes and it was super easy to make because I had everything right here. All I did was set the stencil down, moved it around, and then of course I love to give this a little gradient so you can go from dark to light depending on how heavy handed you are with your <laughs> blending brushes and your Distress Oxides. But this is the sweet, fun, coffee, Starbucks inspired card. Here's this cute little kitty cat that is from your next stamp. It's from this set here called Coffee Right Meow. Again, it's another one of those funny punny cards. This says, just give me my caffeine and no one gets hurt. <laughs> that is absolutely adorable. And of course, a little kitty cat smiling and it is colored with my Copic markers, some of the Copic sketch and some of the regular Copic markers. Very fun card, easy to make. Love, love how this turned out again. This is one of their little mini stencils. Most of their stencils are six by six, so it will be about this size here. Nice, stores very easily away. Very thin, so they don't take up much room at all, but you can definitely turn this into this in just a few minutes. I'm gonna show you how I use this really quickly so you can get a quick glance at how you can use these stencils. I'm gonna use my little grid paper here because I happen to have it handy. And I'm just gonna set this right down here. One of the things that I like to use with my stencils is my low tack tape. I'm going to tear off a little bit here, set this down. And again, you can just make a bunch of different cards by using like a conveyor belt system, which is what I call. You just put everything down, move the stencil from one to the next to the next, and you are good to go. So there's the stencil for this card that I used here. Um, I used Distress Oxide Vintage Photo from Ranger, my Taylor Expressions blending brush. You can use any blender tool blending brush you want. This is one from Dollar Tree, works just the same in my eyes. I am not picky on my brushes. I will use them from anywhere and everywhere. I'm gonna use this here just to hold it in place as I work and show you this beautiful little magic. Again, you can be as heavy handed as you like, or you can do it with a light hand you can do it with a really heavy hand and give you different colors of ink in the same space and these are so fun to work with because it gives you exactly the design that you want you don't have to worry about finding a perfect design or paper you can make your own just use a little stencil and make the design that you would like so i'm just going to finish blending this over here just like that do this little corner here and again all you have to do is take a baby wipe when you're done with this and it will clean right up so I'm going to do that there head over here to these little coffee splatters and show you this little corner here and you that one really really light so you can see here that I didn't put a lot of ink and on this one there is a lot of ink 
Super easy, and that's all we did. I'm gonna lift this up, show you there. How fun is that? Now you have a background that you can take your little stamp images and your little cards. Here's one here and do whatever you like. Look at the little sad kitty. And that goes with that perfect little sentiment that says, um, how am I feeling when you run out of coffee? Depresso. <laughs> so that is super fun. You can just do something just like that. Absolutely love this. Easy to clean up. You just wipe it off with a baby wipe and you are good to go. How fun is that? So you'll be seeing a lot of cards on my Instagram and you'll be seeing them here on my channel as well in January with that super fun and generous little package that arrived. I had fun going through their store. There's so many to choose from. It was actually hard to narrow down the ones that I wanted, but I finally settled on those and it was very sweet of them. So definitely excited to share this with you in the next couple of weeks. Check them out, Colorful Life Designs. I will have them linked in the description box below. So you can also go over and do a little bit of shopping. They have great prices, reasonably priced. And let me tell you, super fly fast shipping. I have my package in just a couple of days. So you're definitely going to want to go and check them out. I've been using them for a couple of years now, and it is going to be amazing to make a couple more paper crafting items with these stencils. That's going to be it for this one, my friends. Thanks so much for watching. Please remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe. If you like my uh, content, go ahead and hit that notification with your uh, with the bell notifications. Leave me a comment. It helps me find your channel as well. I will see you on my next video. Bye-bye.